Hi guys, hi friends, I am Rajkumar Daka here. You are watching our new YouTube channel, STC Study. And please don't forget to subscribe and like our video. Today I am going to say about exam preparation. How to prepare for exam. Though exam is a part of education, but most of the students are afraid of it. You should know that there are many ways to improve our knowledge. But I, may, I want to mention you that you need to know there are two ways. One is negative, one is positive. According to some students, exam is boring, exam create some problems for them exam creates tension for them but most of the students also think that exam is not boring for them Ex exam never creates any tension for them they just think exam is the way to improve their talent so their uh, creativity in front of the world but in my point of view it depends on our minds work and study always remember one thing be positive think positive understand the situation according to the condition and react as soon as possible all these are own calm without a healthy physique so that is why i request you to attention to your health also because health is well Without health, we cannot do anything. So you remember that sleep well and eat healthy food, regular interval. That is very important for your uh, future lives as well as before your exam also. But most of the students, they are not aware about this. They just, what they think, they have to score good marks. But they never mind uh, to uh, their health. That is why they face lots of problems before examination. Here, I want to say you something uh, as per the point. For the first point, you always remember, collect your old question paper. That means previous question papers. So that you can get new idea regarding the upcoming examination. And one more thing you should remember that re study according to syllabus only. Don't go outside of syllabus. Here, I want to mention you one thing. Discipline also part of education. In the answer sheet, you need to maintain your discipline so that examiners can be satisfied through your answer sheet. That is why I request you maintain your timetable, maintain your marks right as per the question marks. But most of this, what they do, uh, if that answer is asked you to write only two marks but if you write four marks question it will be too long and the examiner will feel uh, unsatisfied so that is why i request you not to write like that always write as per the question only and one more thing you should know that always remember that things it doesn't matter what you have study at your home how many hours you have study at your home but it's depend it depend that what you have written within two or three hours in the examination hall so you should notice that things also so that you can get good score in the examination most of the students what they do in the examination hall if they get the question papers and if they see the question and uh, that question is very common for them and they start writing that but i i suggest you not to write like that before you write the question please think at least five or six seconds what the question is asked to you because that will help you to get good score that is why you should always remember to your question also see most of the students what they do they just read and just they try to rem uh, memorize actually. Actually, no need to memorize. What you need to do, you should understand the point. You should understand the main, main point. And what you should do, and you should understand and go ahead. And you should think also. 
and you should uh, remember that things by understanding not by memorize so that is why i say suggest you not to uh, do like that and please whatever you learn always learn by your heart not by your mind and understand also and write what you have learned and write what you have understand and think what you have read but most of the students they never think also the thinking is also a part of education part of a uh, improve your knowledge actually but most of the students what they do that just as simply they read and they try to memorize in the examination hall that is why they fail revise is also one of the good factor to secure good marks in the exam but most of the students they never revise revise whatever you have learned in the early morning if you learn something it is very easy to remember at the same thing in the evening you just revise so everyone knows that in the evening time we feel tired so that is why i request you not to read new things in the evening time try to read something in the morning time only and that time same thing please revise i see what you will get the result thank you so much for watching this video and i request you to subscribe our new channel stc study so that you can get new educational videos